be making a new video on my newest creation. I made this castle a little while ago, but I'm making a video on it now because I need to take down the castle for some pieces for a future map that I'm going to be starting to make. So this isn't my biggest castle that I've ever made, but it's the most detailed and unique, so I hope you like it. So to start off on the outside of the walls of the castle, there is a small forest with some flowers and mushrooms mixed in. Also over here, Robin Hood is looking at the guards, trying to break into the castle to steal the treasure. Over to the right, there is a small farm with a farmer and his cow and his pig, but little does he know that behind this tree there is an army of orcs scaling the castle walls, trying to break in as well to steal the treasure. So over by the drawbridge, there is two soldiers that are guarding it. But the cool part about the drawbridge is that it can be lowered down like this and you can look inside. But then it can be put back up in times of need if uh, the enemy was attacking it. So for the gatehouse, there is a tower on either side with a soldier guarding in, in the middle. Then there are two lionite flags blowing in the wind. Over here, there is a walkway going around the castle. There is one in the center of the castle to protect protect the courtyard, and then one towards the right to protect the house area. Over here, there is the main tower, which where the king and queen would stay, but there's nothing inside because I could not get the floor to work. And over here, there are tower areas where guards can look down at the courtyard to make sure everything's going well. Then over to the left, there is a small staircase where soldiers can come up and look out for enemies. Then inside the courtyard, there is a small garden in the middle. And then around it, there are some shops and storages. Towards the back, there is a small prison, which the guards are escorting an uh, orc inside. And then there are some weapons to make sure that the prisoners don't escape. Then over here, this is a main part of the castle, which is a guest house for a visiting king or queen from another village. Then on top, there is a catapult and some archers to protect it from any attacks that might happen. There's a doorway on the bottom to get into the house with a soldier guarding it. Then on the back, there's not much but some supports. Then the biggest part of the castle is the main house, which protects the gold at the top with three soldiers. Then to get in the house, you can either use this walkway and go into that door, or use the doorway down here. Down in this smaller courtyard, there is a shop that's selling some fish. And also towards the back, they keep their catapult there, just in case of a siege on the castle, which they can fire the catapult out to the enemy. Then over to the right, there is the house area, which is being invaded by orcs. You can't really see the house, but it's the house from the medieval village set that came out from Lego. Also, the king's carriage is put in there just in case the king wants to go out of the castle with it. So that's pretty much it for this mock. I'm going to be creating a new one in the future. It's going to be very detailed. It's going to be a 2 by 2 base plate mock and I think you're going to really enjoy it. So yeah, this has been a WC Brick Films production. I hope you liked it.